Business owners at Military Circle Mall are starting off their week with a lot of questions after learning about the plan to demolish the mall at the beginning of next year. Yeah, news reporter Angela Bohan has been following this story for us. And Angela, I understand there was a meeting today. What can you tell us about that? Well, Barbara, the meeting was held here at the mall. It was hosted by Devaris, the property management company. They invited business owners from inside the mall and on the outskirts of their property. Now, I did ask the Economic Development Office for the city if media could attend today's meeting. They said no, but we did speak with a jewelry shop owner who was there at the meeting, and here's what he had to say. We asked for the you know, rent reduction that, you know, is going to be hard for us. We just come out from the corona and it's hard and now it's, that thing happened. So we are really, really in a bad situation. That's the owner of Bronx Jewelers who says he's worked in this mall half of his life and he really wants to stay in this area. He told me there were probably about 40 or 50 merchants at this morning's meeting and that they really didn't get any answers, but the property management did take down their concerns. Last week, I talked with the director of the Economic Development Office for the city of Norfolk. He said they will provide some type of relocation assistance. However, he couldn't give us any details on that. You'll recall last week, business owners were given a letter stating that they needed to be closed by December 31st. But now some are asking for an extension so that hopefully they can be open for the entire Christmas holiday season. And I spoke with the property management company last week, but I've been unable able to reach them today for comment and coming up on News 3 at 530. We'll hear more details about what the jewelry shop owner and other merchants are planning to do later this month. Live in Norfolk, Angela Bohan, News 3.